And there we go. We have now got access to advanced lasers. Oh! No, that's not just access. That's given us advanced lasers. Okay, so it's not the advanced laser weaponry, it's literally just that. I see. It's not. Ah, okay, so it's not split into just laser weapons. Okay. And we have factories again. So our factories have been massively churning out resources. Um, what do we need? Cargo planes. Let's get up to five of those. In fact, I would even say that those are probably more important than the recons. Especially because they're going to take a long time to develop. Power armor. Uh, we could produce more of those. I was wondering if we wanted to do the tax breaks, but I really don't think we can afford to because of this. Troll Warren probably lost a ton of manpower against the Western Brotherhood. Uh, Washington Brotherhood. Oh yeah, they 100% would have. Measured freedom. We've been proud to build a nation of personal freedom and responsibility. Thinking of ourselves as anything other than a free people is fatalistic and fearful. Our respect for each other is what matters the most. How much is this new army going to cost me? <laughs> A lot. Hey Katie. Came here to hide out because Amy is making fun of a Klingon vessel in Star Trek Online saying it <laughs> looks like interesting. Okay. Uh, and there we go. Justification is complete. Where's the... Oh, we're still researching it. Get me more of those. Um, right. Let's save the game. And then declare war. Oh yes, please move your men away from here. That would be fantastic of you. <laughs> Alright, time for us to cross over. Oh yes, and I did mean call all. War! We're going to war! <laughs> How's the Air Force doing? Because <laughs> it's such a short front, we're only getting 20 planes in here. But they will break before we do. Since this is Texas, instead of defeating the bull, can you ride the bull? The die is cast. We have crossed the Rubicon. Oh, we're about to cross the Rubicon. Nope, we have actually crossed the Rubicon. 
And so it begins. The north's not looking hot. The north isn't where this is going to be won or lost. The centre is. And if they're determined to try and cross down here, that's just going to be losses after losses after losses. And in fact, you guys have actually managed to cross down here. Interesting. I mean, if my allies want to form a crossing, who am I to say no? I think one thing that I will do is I'm going to leave the power armor guys just sitting on this crossing. I just don't have a counter to this. I'm going to say delete that and just make an attack for Flagstaff. And then any of you which are in the southern push, join the northern. We'll just use that as a, a holding out position. the southern flank. Now don't stop. Keep pushing. Gotta keep up this momentum, people. Come on! And talking of momentum... We also need to keep building air bases as we go, because the Legion definitely doesn't have any. Our overwhelming fire support. Oh, uh, you lot don't have enough fighters. Is that a problem? I doubt it. Who's saying they don't have an air force? They're lying. Both of them do. Also, I need to change your colours because I have no idea which is which. Let's make you green. Ah, you're purple. Let's make you a less purple. Let's make you yellow. So these were the greens. So that second fighter wing should actually be with them. You're in the middle, you're at the bottom, you're in the north. Perfect. And there's so many special forces going north, I think I might just have all of you joining that southern push. You can just hold on to this southern area. In fact, you know what else I'm going to do? We're going to say... Guess I'm planning prep to go there. I'm not necessarily saying do that, but be in a position where you can. God save Kaisar. He's gonna need saving. <laughs> Vital point targeting. Uh, let's go for better recon. Let's go for not using any of those. You're all complete. Not using any of those. You're all done. So are you. Get out of the way. There's too many of you. There's 
still being worked on. These have all, most all been completed. Spread freedom. Our people are lucky to live here, but what about those who aren't so lucky? Despots and tyrants threaten their villages more than they do us. But that doesn't excuse their terror. We have a duty to all of those suffering. A duty to bring them into the Texan way of life. That's just an easy way of saying, bring them into Texas. Yeehaw. Caesar's legions already lost 5,000. Lots of few. You know what? It'd be very easy to get a cutoff here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cancel your current order. And I'm going to say you're going to be responsible for punching up to there. And I'm going to say all the special forces are going to go in this southern sector. And then all of the vehicles are going to go in this northern sector. That's not all of them. That is. And yes, please do attack. Oh yeah, yellow can definitely launch an attack now. You're not wrong. Oh no, he's the special forces guy. Ah! Bring in early. He'll just have to learn very quickly on the job. Very, very quickly. Pilot, cool. Cooling jacket, that was the incinerator. And with that, I'm basically done with technology. Why are you attacking? Don't attack. That's not your job. Uh, trade, we become an expert negotiator. Oh no, we already are an expert negotiator, so we get consumer goods factories down, stability up, caps income down for th a year. Sure, sounds good. Military training, that was dogs, which we can upgrade. Aha! Another full army. Cool. Deploy. And then I'm going to want you lot. Over here, I think. Imperial Mexico declared war on us, but we have got lots of troops down here, so I'm not really concerned. Actually, we don't have as many troops as I thought we did. Now we do. 
Yeah, we probably do need more air bases. You're not wrong. Kaisar's legions lost 15, 16,000. I've lost 600. <laughs> so it turns out, air force in this game, very strong. Not to mention special forces which you've built for mobility and attack. Like that six kilometer movement speed is deadly. Yeah, I've got three militaries, but the state of my industry right now, I don't really care. Like, we have so many more than enough materials that it's just unconsequential at this point. So I do want to continue building factories. We have level 10 infrastructure everywhere as well. Uh, I want to keep building the factories because that's going to be, continue to increase my income. And that's the only thing we're, we're potentially a little lacking. Economic sectors bypassed. Oh, TAA. And there we go. Focus tree is done. Right, well, I guess we're just going to be gaining political power at this point so we can cause stuff. Not nitpicking, but is it unconsequential or inconsequential? It's probably actually inconsequential. I thought that when I said it. In fact, no, probably it is. Why can I? Oh. Drawing the wrong kinds of lines. And then there's this just mess of the Rockies. But it's also a massive cutoff. Vertibird. Oh, we can't get it. You were right. Okay. I was going to say, is that going to allow me to bypass it? Because it's not telling me that I can't. So no, we would need scientific air tech plus the vertebrate schematic. So that was just the transports. Um, which does what? Are they literally just cargo planes? They are literally just cargo planes. but with more than double the range. They also have 240 production cost. Not necessary. Too bad, that would have been nice. We are not going to be responsible for guarding these bits. 
There's enough men over there. Yeah, they can probably attack now. And yellow is too. Here comes the attack on Flagstaff. The city of Flagstaff, long the seat of Caesar's absolute power, fell late last night to the Provisional Republic of Texas. Although the Kaiser asked to stay to command the defence until defeat was almost certain, even his military wisdom could not save the city, surrounded, as it was, by the Provisional Republic of Texas's earlier pincer movements. In his infinite wisdom, Kaiser ordered a last stand, commanding his elite Praetorian Guard to fire on any units that attempted to desert. Ultimately, the order only served to delay the capture of the city at large by a day. Although, even now, sporadic fighting continues between the invading forces and the Praetorian Guard units holed up in buildings. Kaisar's palace also appears to be still holding out, although this might shortly change when the Provisional Republic of Texas demolition teams get into position. How did the Legion have this many slaves? Want slaves, soon to be citizens of the Provisional Republic. Can you guys stop getting shot? Please. Can everyone stop getting shot? So now the Legion's on the block, nice. Texas OP, please nerf. I mean, there are certainly a couple of things about them which are quite strong. Uh, old World Political Guide. Political power gain, subversive activities reduction, improve relations maintained down, guarantee cost down, economy law, trade law, conscription law. Interesting. Training of the next unit is almost done. Butcher Pete requests lowered tariffs. Sure. So it does kind of look like they've made Lanius really interesting at the cost of Kaisar. Or it might just be because Caesar's Legion, uh, because the NTR died, that Caesar's Legion just didn't have very much to do. Also possible. But this has certainly been something of a demolition. No! Oh, shit. Why is that disbanding an army? Uh. Oh, it's because it's selecting you. There we go.
Okay. Fixed. Although this is also going to trounce our um, manpower. Because these units aren't nearly as hardy as the special forces or the APCs. In fact, I think I might even just send the special forces to go and attack Phoenix. Choctaw Nation demands territory. I, 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 are you sure you want to do this, Choctaw Nation? This, this seems like a silly move. I mean, if you're going to do it, then certainly while I'm at war with the uh, Caesar's Legion, sure. Uh, but yeah, yeah. All right, dogs are fully upgraded. Recon is not. Kaisar's legions lost 33,000? I've lost one. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Guys have almost actually finished your orders. Two sons down there. I must remember them. I'm at war with this. In fact, I'm at war with Gentadel Sol as well, so I'm at war with all of this. However, the Legion forces here in the north are gone. So all of my tanks are moving over to that side. Cool. 33 to 1, kill death. Yeah, it's not gone too badly. And we're about to get another 24 stack. Which I could actually just deploy over here. And I probably need to. I guess they decided not to declare war because I ignored their ultimatum. Mexico is also dying. Yes, true. Um, right. You. No, you. Still going though, that's good. What the blazes is going on here? Who knows?
38,000 losses to my two. Nine. What's left? Uh, it's just these little areas out here. And there it is. Well done, team. So, Genta del Sol, liberating you. Tucson, puppeting you. Kaisos Legion. Oh, no, wait, not liberate. Not liberate! Tucson, Cowboy Country, Bordeo Ranchers, Huapai, Twisted Hairs, Las Granias, Blackfoot, Tensigns, Denitar, Cyphers, Flagstaff, Red Sun Republic, Genta del Sol, and Kaisar's Legion were all puppeted. And now the Texan Economic Union flows across all of this, except for the Fakan Colony, which is, oh sorry, Picos Colony, which is kind of hilarious. But this, this is over. We've won this. We're done here. I don't think that anyone can really stand up against us now. Who rules the Legion? I do. It is now Prefectus Blasius. Now, TNO. No, we'll be doing another game. Need to decide as whom, though, because I'm not sure yet. I don't know if I necessarily want to start it now with half an hour to go. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to sign this one off for YouTube, so Twitch, don't go anywhere. We have more things to talk about. But thanks everyone on YouTube for watching. I do hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, hit that subscribe button to get notifications when new videos go live. If you've really enjoyed this, then do consider supporting it over on patreon.com slash mordredviking. Or you can, of course, come join us live on Twitch, which you can find at twitch.tv slash mordredviking. It's always a real pleasure. And you get more direct input into what is going on. Anyway, for now, thanks everyone for watching. If you have any comments, hit me up in the comment section. I do read everything. Bye.